Pat, it's Midnight Designer, and we are back playing Seven Days Today. And we got it all done, and I'm going to go down here and grab some ladders real quick um, so that we can go up. Let's see, where, 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 where? I have metal somewhere, I think. Yeah, let's use the metal. Use the metal ladders. So I've got the maze basically laid out. Uh, right now it is uh, two blocks high because I'll be honest with you, um, it used up what, what I have right here in my inventory. That is all the wood I own in all of Seven Days to Dinus. Um, I used to be the king of all wooden media and I am no longer because one, two, three, time. Look at this. Doesn't this look cool? I'm pretty happy. I am pretty happy with how this turned out. Uh, I do want to do a third level so that they're three high. Um, and eventually we will have, um, some other stuff happening, uh, maybe some sniper towers on the corners of our base. Um, who knows? Uh, it's all exciting, but the possibilities are endless. We did get it done uh, before the 77-day horde, uh, so that is very cool. Um, and this may be a better vantage point for sniping fools, um, but I don't know. Uh, that is something that we will have to figure out. But how cool does it look? I think it looks pretty awesome. Of course, I am biased. And as you can see, I did extend the, um, the bridge to run all the way out and then to the nonsense down below. We've retained our, um, patches here so I think it looks awesome it is awesome sauce now obviously it does not have it's not very strong well what we're really trying to measure here is uh, how the the uh, zombie AI handles a maze so I mean if we get if, if they come in and then they attack the first block they come to and then just make a straight line plowing through until they get to the base then we have our answer so it doesn't matter if it takes them a lot of time or a little time to get here they're gonna die anyway so you know so that's fine so we have um, we have coffee we have drink we have bullets I made another stack of crossbow bolts and right now what we are going to do is we are going to hoof it um, to the other base to spend the night over there at the main base. Because in today's episode, as promised, we are going to Has Adventure. We are going into the main hub and it is the quest for zero zero. We are going to head to zero zero and we are going to dominate it. And then we are going to explore the main base and uh, hopefully there will be adventure and excitement happening there so you stay tuned and when we come back it will be morning and i will be at the other base setting off fat man we ain't got no time sun about to go down so i will see you in the morning and we're back and it's morning and we are back at our OG base. Somebody's out here pounding on something. All right, well. I don't know where you are, but do your thing. You're awesome. Now, I think the trees are uh, mature. So let's, because I have a working theory. As you know, we came back here before and the trees were not coming down. So first I'm gonna check this tree 
to see if it gives us okay this gives, that gave us seven logs that means these trees are fully grown now if my theory is correct the the fully grown trees when we pull the wood frame will drop yes do you feel me okay so the uh, the wood frame tree farm still works the secret is that you must wait until the fruit trees are fully grown um, in order to take advantage so it is not an issue of if you got your saplings from a previous uh, version of to game it is not an issue of anything other than the trees must be fully grown before uh, you take them down now you can kind of tell by eyeballing them uh, looking at the base <coughs> excuse me here and that is a full what a fully grown tree looks like um, the in order to be completely safe I would advise that you um, Okay, I don't need metal ladders. I would advise that you cut down, if you build a, a farm like this, I would advise that you cut down a tree first to make sure it gives you seven logs before you begin pulling them all down. So, we are heading into the wasteland. Uh, zero, zero is about right here. As you can see, if you look at the map, uh, the bottom left, uh, corner of the map shows you the coordinates of your arrow. That is your current position, cleverly labeled current position. Um, so I put a flag at around zero, zero. That's where that is. We can hit our hardware stores on the way. We'll do some looting and stuff. Uh, but I want the, I, what I would like to do is hit the right button. What I would like to do is get as much of this mapped out as possible. I think it continues up this way and this way. We know it at least comes up here. Um, and it may follow the river some, uh, but let's map this out and uh, maybe get some nice things. Some nice parting gifts is a twerp. So let's head into the city. And we'll whack some fools along the way, get some practice. Hello. Why can I never do the run and single hit? I never get the critical hit when it's really critical. So, alright. So, it is, uh, we are now into like the third week of February, I suppose. Um, so we maybe have about two more weeks on this map before Mad Mole and the fellas over at the Fun Pimps uh, kill it for us. Um, so, we will work on the base off and on. But if you have any suggestions for another project, I had we had talked about maybe building something inside the hub city. Uh, we can maybe do that. Um, you know, we I mean, there, there's plenty of, to do at the Games for P Kicks amazing base. Uh, there is obviously um, the maze to be finished. Uh, and experiments to be conducted vis-a-vis -vis that. Um, in particular, there is um, the uh, possibility of like guard tower type structures. Okay, let's put stuff on the bar here so we are not. We don't. We don't. We don't mess around. Hey. So, guard towers, we have to put a third level. Ooh, nice. So, there is, these have respawned. So, nice for us. Flashlight engaged. And now they're all opened. I will, I should smash very few of them along the way. That is the theory. Um, <clears throat> so, we'll see if that holds out. Um, I guess I can collect these for scrap iron. Ooh, auger, auger, auger. Oi, oi, oi. That's always good. Another auger. That, that, that gives us three augers. Seems like a lot. Ho, ho, ho. Nice. Weapon repair kit. 
And let's see, close you off. Okay, now let's see here. Trash can, let's put away you. And let's scrap you, and you, and you. <laughs> oh, Games for Kicks. If you're watching this, uh, Games for Kicks, I have two augers, and I don't need any more. But that will give me a ton of scrap. Can I do it? I can't do it. I can't do it. I may do it at some point when inventory becomes an issue. But, oh, that would be terrible. How rich do you have to be in seven days to die to scrap an auger? Be like, yes, you know, lighten your campfires with $100 bills. But, you know, if you've got two augers already... You've got an auger. You've got a backup auger. Um, what are you going to do with more augers? That's my question to you. What do you do with more augers? So put that in the comment section. What should I do with my bonus augers that I now have? So I would like to know. I mean, I feel bad because there's folks out there who have no augers, you know, and it's like... Uh, the old line that your parents give you, well, you know, there's starving children in blah de blah and you should eat your peas as a result of that. Um, and I hate for it to be that away, but, you know, at the same time, how do you scrap an auger? So, if, since I now have three augers, Pat, tell me in the comments what I should do with them. And if you say stick it where the sun don't shine, uh, that would make me sad, but that would be pretty funny, so I would have to give you points for that. Alright. So we have cleared both of our... Now, I wish I remembered what the configuration was that was a... Um, now, this is, a, this is an empty lot. This is an empty lot. This, I think, is a parking garage. Okay, well, first things are first, as you know, hence the name. We still need to head to zero, zero. So let's continue to head to zero, zero. It is quiet in here. I worried about, you know, is there a problem with spawns? But first of all, that's one of those things. That's one of those things that will come back to haunt you when you get swarmed. And if you remember when you were saying, where are all the zombies at? Well, here they are. Plus, there's hornets. So, must be zombies somewhere, right? This is weird. I wonder if we um, have generated so many zombies in the other area that... Um, They just aren't... There's no room in the cap? Well, wait. There's a fat man. Or is a cop. Okay. It's just weird that there are so few in this area. Don't you think? You know, I ain't... I ain't gonna complain. Well, I guess I'm complaining a little. It just seems weird. Because we clearly passed zombies on the way in, right? We clubbed several zombies on the way in to the hub city. Come back! Come back! I'm a botanist, or a zoologist, or a, uh, uh, what do you call, what do you call the thing, the people, the, the things, the, the people that study, uh, giant mutant hornets. Uh, I think you call them science fiction writers. Okay, so zero zero is still that way. Um, but not very far. So let's give that officer some wide berth. Whoa. <laughs> Hello, ho. Now, I have heard tell that there is almost always a safe. And look at that. There is. And we don't want any of you. Look at it. We've already got a full inventory. Wait. No. Craft you into scrap craft you into scrap 
So it was true. You can find gun safes in the holes. Wait, Hornet? I think the Hornet called the police. Okay, so let's just pop. Oops, <laughs> reload. That would have been a beautiful headshot right there. Hey, buddy. Pop. Go down. Go down, son. Know your role. Uh-oh. Spider zombie and dog. He's mad. Okay. Is it? Is this a... Uh, no, that's not another spider zombie. Okay. So. The zombies are... Are making themselves known. Let us not be foolish about things. Let's get the... Come on. Hornet. Either fish or cut bait. You know what I'm saying? Fish or cut bait. I don't know why I bother to get the honey. I never, ever use it. I simply collect it. And that's that. Okay. Zero, zero. How close are we? We're very close. So this is apparently the zero, zero block, the sum of all fears, the thing that uh, started it all. Th maybe we should rebuild this, right? This is the center of disaster. This is where it, it's zero, zero, right? Seems like a, um, like a safe assumption that this is where it all began. I wonder if we find any clues as to why there was an apocalypse. We are undetected. Are we sensed? Are, do they have that cheaty uh, hub city sense of not really knowing where we are, but then somehow still being able to walk to exactly our position? Wait, where are you? Oh, there you are. Hey, buddy. So this is the zero, zero house, or is it? Yeah, this is basically it. This is the zero, zero house. That's nasty. Could clean up the joint. I mean, for historical purposes, somebody should restore the structure. Oh, look at you guys. Jump, 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 jump. Well, that's something to consider. Should we try to restore for historical purposes, or <laughs> as I play video games, hysterical purposes, policemen run the other way. Just like in real life. Just kidding. Um, so let's go over here and uh, make you some map happen. And this is, is this a shotgun messiah? I really ought to learn like what the stores look like. Shotgun messiah. Is this an unopened, unadulterated shotgun messiah? I think it is. Look at that. Shotgun messiah, FTW, OMG, LOL, BRB. Smash the door. And we're in. Flashlight engaged. Okay, now. This is where we find out if I have been paying attention to anything as it relates to video games. Uh, let's get rid of you. Get rid of you. Craft you up. Um, get rid of you. Okay. Now, can I go through an entire, an entire uh, shotgun messiah without destroying a single crate? I won't even care if we don't find anything. Although longtime viewers will point out that we are still looking for parts to the 44 Magnum. But I will not care if we find literally nothing. If I can go through an entire shotgun messiah and not destroy a single crate. That for me will be a victory for video game players everywhere. And you know who you are, Pat. The smashers. The dashers. The ones who don't necessarily pay a lot of attention when they're playing. But who still want to enjoy a good video game. Maybe you watch something on the other screen. Maybe you're watching my video right now while you're playing 7 Days to Die on another screen. 
Maybe that's what's happening right now. Maybe I shouldn't talk so much. I'm distracting you. Maybe my video game sounds are distracting you. Maybe you think that there's a dog coming up to you in your world. It, don't worry. It's in my world. Okay. Oh, I hear you, Snuffleupagus. All right. And pickaxe. Dog, you can't get through no walls. Oh, uh, look at all of this. None of it, none of it is the part to a 44 mag. Where are you breaking in, dog? All right, whatever. All right, uh, this, and this, and this, and this, and this, and this, and we'll keep that. What the heck? But we don't need any more of those. And metal doors we'll put in there. And and take you. Wait, wait, what? Oh, did I? Arr, arr. All right, let's do it again. You know what? I'm just going to scrap. I can't keep stuff in there and not scrap it. Uh, okay. And you go up. What are all of you people doing? Or by people, I mean undead people and dogs. And your furry companions. Uh, take the brass. Take not the hat. Take not that. Take not any of that. Nice. Alright. Oh! Hey, doggy. Oh, your AI is worse than mine. Your AI is worse than mine. Alright, so let, let us get into the door for some more of a score. Let's try to get this done in the next couple of minutes. Hey, doggy, don't break that. Don't break that, it's not paid for. All right, so let's do this. Are you ready? Watch me not break any crates. Another part that we already have. All right, let's see here. You go up here, you go away. Um, you I'll keep because I can't bear to throw away 44 parts. Um, okay, and did I get, get you out, okay. and more okay so let's craft you into scrap and take oh midnight what are we getting rid of um, oops backwards one two three four nope Okay, that's gonna go. And let's see, hold this for a second. This is gonna go, hold this for a second. And then you go in here, you go in here, uh, you go in here, craft. And you go away. Pick you. And get rid of you once and for all. Okay, we're outie. We are outie. So. Whoa. Wait. 
did you see me? Are you in? Is did the call come from inside the house? All right. Well. Oh no. Uh. <laughs> hi guys. Um. Uh, why don't you guys both work on that, and then we are going to make a left turn and take a long walk off a short pier. Really? That worked. <laughs> That's right, officer. Those two guys are breaking into that store. All right, well, we've made it out. Oh, not a good place to do the end of the episode thing. All right. So, in the next episode, we will conclude our Zero Zero adventure. But in the meantime, we raided a shotgun messiah and did not break a single block. So, that alone deserves a like. But in general, if you like this video, please hit the like button. If you want to see more, subscribe. If you want to start a conversation, why don't you start one? Where? In the comment section below. Look at y'all doing a thing. It's awesome. Thanks for watching, and have a great day.